On page 5 of BoardStat, you will find a clustered bar chart of the service requests by year broken down by month. On the top of the page, you can choose a specific community board, complaint type, descriptor, or date range to narrow down your search. On the bottom of the bar chart, on the x-axis, you can see the months. While on the left side, the y-axis shows call volume. This tutorial will demonstrate how to use BoardStat to identify trends in complaint types across months and years. We will also spot a data quality issue. Our example will show how some complaint types have been added to the system or edited over time, so you might not see some complaint types in the years before they were officially added or after they were discontinued and merged with others. In this video, we will look into the heating a complaint type that was discontinued and merged with heat and hot water in 2014 by using page 5 of BoardStat. As with the other BoardStat pages, our previous community board selection and date range remains in effect. As with the other BoardStat pages, our previous community board selection and date range remain in effect. Let's change the date range back to January 2010 to December 2018 to include all current data. Then, let's choose Heating from the Complaint Type menu and Heat as a descriptor. The bar chart allows you to compare not only call volume by year, but call volume broken down by month. Note that when you select a descriptor, only the complaint types that are associated with it will be available for selection. Some service requests are more relevant during certain months or times of the year. So this page can help compare these months between years. Here, we can see that, as one might assume, for every year, there were many more heating service requests in the winter months compared to the warmer months. And over here, we can see that the heating service request ended in 2014. This might be confusing if we were not aware that the heating complaint type was merged with heat and hot water complaint type after 2014. Selecting heat hot water, we can see that it was added in 2014 and is still used today. You can choose multiple complaint types and descriptors, and the data will be aggregated into one bar per month for each year. So it would be more accurate to choose both heating and heat hot water to get a better picture of the service request made over the years. We see the same trends, but now there are less gaps in our data. If we right-click on one of the bars, we see the familiar options. See records, show data, include, and exclude. Clicking on see records will show us the total number of service requests in tabular format for the bar's specific complaint type and the bar's color-coded year and month. Show data will show us data for the entire bar graph in both graph and tabular format. In this view, we can also toggle between vertical and horizontal views using the familiar switch to vertical or horizontal layout. Include will focus only on that specific data set and exclude will eliminate it from that specific data set. That's it for page 5. Now, let's go to page 6.